here's John John. Welcome, YouTubers, subscribers, followers, ladies and gentlemen, friends and foes. Let's go, Santa Monica, California. Thank you. What I want to do is take you up to the freeway, folks. Don't forget to get vaxxed. Yeah, right. Uh, and I want to show you what the freeway looks like now that we just got off the off-ramp at 4th Street. So stay with me on this one, folks. I've been actually trying to get you this little story, this cover, for quite a while. And it's taken me a while to do it. Okay, so if you... If I zoom in here, that's basically the back end of the promenade, Third Street promenade. And what I wanted to try to capture for you many times is what the freeway looks like coming into Santa Monica. Now, as you can see right here, this is a police department and you saw the folks hanging out on the side. So they have a tough job because of the heavy tourism, but the freeways are just destroyed like they are pretty much everywhere in California and all the signs and everything so you see the back of the signs there stay with me let's do it unedited folks so just stay with me that way I don't have to edit it and that way you don't have to think you're missing something or John John's trying to be like the other guys that edit John John doesn't edit John John loves the truth I hope you're liking my videos I appreciate all the subscribers because I'm out of the uh, single digits now. I actually make more than $1.25 uh, an hour um, with the channel. And I just love doing it. But I still have a few years left where I've got to, uh, you know, eat some bread and lettuce. Stay with me. So here you go. That zooms you right down into Santa Monica. The, the nicest part, the promenade, the ocean in the backdrop there. Police department, graffiti right on the sign. It's been smudged next to the police department sign. And what we're going to do is capture some of this, this video for you. Some of this scenery um, that is really grotesque. And I just think that all the blame has got to be put on Newsom because these are state highways. And uh, you know the motto. You don't stop it. It will come. 10 eastbound, Santa Monica. You're probably going to hear some honking because John John is trying to capture the truth. It's not easy. That's why I'm the only one doing it. There's Santa Monica High School right there. It's a nice mural they put on the side. Route 66. But then you look over to the left and you go, well... <laughs> Well, that's not too nice. We got some camps. We got some remains. Remains of what? I am not sure. Some camps here. Okay, let's make sure we get them for you. No hallucinations. And you can see they've been trying to clean up and I don't know what that means. But they're basically destroying all the uh, agriculture on the side of these freeways, thinking they're doing something nicer. It would all be temporary anyways. And then who pays for these, these guys that don't want to work and act like homeless? What they do is they dupe the system. Everybody knows it. You just keep acting like there's something wrong with you, and then eventually you qualify qualify for all the free stuff you just keep acting like you can't work you got sore shoulders um, loss of memory and that's what you do that's how you dupe the system and then when you dupe the system the money has to go for that instead of this and then what they do and I guess this was on a national level is then they say, we need to build the infrastructure, and then people buy into it. Because they see, wow, the infrastructure is falling apart. It's falling apart because they're rerouting funding. So this should have all been taken care of. But when you let people wander around 
tweak, poop, twerp, lawlessly, you know, um, with impunity, then this is what you're going to get. Now remember, let's not forget, it's the Santa Monica Freeway. This is coming right out of Santa Monica, folks. Oops. There's a Kirk clunkage. All right. It's a cost of doing business. Stay with me. We know this is after the NBA championship because the Bucks won it. The Milwaukee Bucks won the NBA championship. So, therefore, we know that this is far after the COVID dynamic. And look at that, folks. All right. There you have it. Again, Santa Monica Freeway. Eastbound. Keep it going. This is what it looks like. Everything's tagged, signs, it doesn't matter. They tag it. It's lawless. Lawlessness in Los Angeles. How's that for a slogan? Is it lost in Seattle? Is that what it was? Something like that? Sleeping in Seattle. Well, now we've got lawlessness in Los Angeles, which we've had for quite a while. And these, this started happening a few years back, um, but sadly enough, it's still happening in Santa Monica. They love these brick buildings, so no longer do you see brick, you see nice painted brick which is not the same as nice old brick. It's a real spit in the face to the bricklayers. All right. Now, we're coming up on West Los Angeles. And uh, once you get to Sentinella, then, then you're out of then you're out of Los Angeles, uh, out of Santa Monica. As soon as you get to Sentinella, that's the cutoff point. That's the border from Santa Monica City that that you start entering West Los Angeles, which basically the city of LA. So. We'll take it up a little bit further. Stay with me and you can just see a little bit more ghettoized freeway. Because this is some good footage I can capture for you with the lighting. Just look at that sign. Look at that. Isn't that wonderful? That's what they're into here. They're definitely into it. The people that live here, they love graffiti. Throwing some trash, urine cocktails. All right, you have your little urine cocktail in Venice, and then you drive home and you check out all this stuff. And you know your head's spinning a little bit from from some sipping, and um, you'll never know the difference. You'll think that it's bouncing back. So this is 16 months into this game now. All right. 16 months, not 16 weeks, not 16 days, and people still think it's getting better. See, personally, I don't like to see my freeways like that because I know what's going down. It's all graffiti. Well, how do you know it's graffiti, John? I don't know. I was just kind of thought it was just a guess you know I don't know no 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 telling signs that there was graffiti under that I'm just guessing okay stay with me John John love it. 
shit. Let's just cross over the 405, folks. Stay with me. That's it right there. LA, Sac, Long Beach. There you go. Sacramento. Go up to Newsom. Okay, that clown. I don't think they're going to vote him out, folks. I don't think so. I got one last vote here. I was going to actually vote for him and do the pile on. Uh, you know, since everybody loves him so much, I could just be the last guy peeing on him. But the great Eldersky threw his hat in the ring. And uh, John John loves Larry Elder. So I'm going to have to go with the Eldersky. But if not him, I was just going to do the pile on with Newsom. And I don't think Larry's going to win. I think Newsom gets it. Because the people are so mentally demented here. They've got some serious, serious um, compromised consciences that they'll just continue to vote the same way. You know, it's just, it's just the way it is, man. It's just the way it is. As these uh, young Cub Scouts say, it is what it is. Got Bev Hills in the back. Hazy day, see that in the background right there next to the bushes. I kind of lost it there for a minute, but that was Century City Bev Hills. I'd like to cut this one short. There's a lot more ghetto up ahead, but I'm gonna just out it right now. All right, John John, out! Santa Monica Freeway, eastbound. Santa Monica, Los Angeles. Thank you. Out. Oh.